Hello there, it's Mark here from Excel Off The Grid. In this video, we're looking at how we can make a worksheet very hidden. That means a user can't even see that that worksheet is there. So if you're ready, let's get started. So here in Excel, we have this report and you can see that we have a number of tabs that then support this report. For example, we have a calculations tab, we have a marketing spend tab, a marketing budget tab, and a source files tab. Now we want the end user to see the report tab, but not necessarily any of the others. So what we can do is on this calculations tab, I can right click and select hide, and it disappears from those list of tabs. But equally, an end user can just come and right click, unhide, select that sheet, click OK, and now that tab has appeared again. So an end user can easily see that that tab still exists. Now it wouldn't be great if there were a way to hide these worksheets so that a user doesn't even know that they're there. For that, we need the developer tab. So I'm just going to right click on an empty space, come down to customize the ribbon. On the right hand side, I'm going to scroll down until I find this developer option. I'll select that and then click OK. I have a new tab at the top called developer. From there, I can click properties. And then I have this drop down that is used to describe the visible status of this worksheet. So it can be visible, hidden, or very hidden. If I select hidden, that is exactly the same as if we were to hide a worksheet normally. So I could come back, go to unhide, and then I could unhide that worksheet. But alternatively, if we went to a very hidden worksheet, we select, you can see that unhide doesn't even exist as an option. That means the user can't unhide this worksheet using that normal method. So let me very hide all these other sheets. Perfect, all we have that's visible now is our report that we actually want the user to see. Now obviously the question then comes, well, how do I make it visible again? Because perhaps you want to make some changes or some edits. So go to the developer tab, and then go to the Visual Basic option. Here you can still see that we have these individual worksheets. So I'm going to make my Properties window visible. And from there, you can see the visible property of each of those worksheets. So for calculation, you can see it's currently very hidden. I'm going to change that to visible, and I can do that for all of my other worksheets as well. So even though we can make our worksheets very hidden, by coming into the Visual Basic Editor, we can make them all visible again. So there we go, that's just a useful way by which we can hide our worksheets so that other users won't even know that they're there. That's all for this video. If you would like to take your Excel skills to the next level and save huge amounts of time with Excel, then why not check out our training program over at excelofthegrid.com forward slash academy. Thanks for watching and I'll catch you next time.